Hey, good morning, Melissa. It's starting to warm up out here, and it feels great. It's going to be a beautiful day for this. Uh, thousands of people out here today. They're almost about to reach their goal, hopefully very soon. They've already passed the amount they uh, raised last year, 800,000. Uh, now they're past 900,000 and could be uh, passing their record, uh, their previous record. Now, right now, we've got many people joining uh, for the walk. I'm with one of those uh, right now, Brian Eagle. Uh, Brian, thank you for joining me this morning. Uh, your group, I understand, has raised the most so far. If you want to tell me real fast, how much did you guys raise this year? Well, I appreciate that, and we've been blessed with great and generous clients, colleagues, and uh, our staff has been outstanding. We've raised over $50,000. Wow, that's that's incredible. Uh, that that's a lot of money. Uh, awesome that you guys have been able to do that. You've been participating in this event since 2018. Is that right? Uh, that is correct. We are on a quest to help the Alzheimer's Association and Alzheimer's Research to raise the white flower, which represents the first survivor of Alzheimer's. Yeah, as I've I've got my purple flower with me right now, and as we know, many people are picking up theirs. Um, you want to see that white one, but you also have a, a personal connection to this as well. Yeah, my my story, my journey with Alzheimer's starts at a young age. My um, great aunt, I'm named after my great uncle, and my great aunt had Alzheimer's. Later on, during my journey in 2018, my father-in-law passed away of complications from Alzheimer's. And that same year, my great friend, mentor Mike, shared with me that um, he has Alzheimer's. And he's actually the chairman of our walk team. He is the inspiration behind what we do. And um, his journey the last four years has been a difficult one. And um, I'm hoping that he's able to attend today with his, uh, with his son, Sam. So um, we are on a quest to make a difference. Our mission is to give back. My parents always taught me that the world is bigger than oneself. And we're hoping that with our help and everyone else out yeah. here today, that we can make a, a, a difference and unlock uh, the disease and live in a world without Alzheimer's. Certainly, certainly. And uh, many people are gathering right now uh, great cause, and I appreciate you sharing your story and, and the many stories that we've gone to hear today. Uh, Melissa, we'll send it back to you.